Hello folks, welcome to Duena Tech channel. Today I'm going to help you how to uh, customize a Strapi admin UI by changing uh, icons and also labels. As you see here on the login page, I updated this login page icon to my channel brand and also I updated this title and subtitle comparing to a previous one that before update this one was using Strapi icon and was using this old title and this subtitle. And also if we need to compare the forget password that uh, I only updated here the icon for forget password form or page and same here if I go to the forget passwords it's still using strapi icon so you can customize this to display your brand icon instead of strapi and same as well if we try go back and try login if after login here if you notice on the home page here the tab icon here on the top uh, is updated to my brand icon as well you can do for your project for example if i logged in here this is before the update so this uh, home page was using a strappy icon instead. Next icon we can compare as well here, this is the menu icon. So the menu icon has been updated and the menu title and subtitle as well. This is updated to store dashboard and subtitle testing. And originally it was a strappy dashboard workplace. So as well, we can update the, we can remove here the tutorial icons. So if you come back here, if you see still here we have this tutorials icon when if we need to remove that we can remove it as well if you need to stop to get any strapi uh, upgrade notification then also we can stop that this is what we are going to learn on this tutorial and let's just going showing you directly how we can do this in code <laughs> So you need to run your server locally. I'm running here my server and this is the code. You need to navigate to source directory inside your server and then go to admin. And we need to change this app.example to be just app.js instead. Then inside here, we need to just remove all this localization. We are not gonna to touch this in this uh, tutorial. If you are interested in localization, just leave that down on the comment section and I will create a tutorial for that. Inside this config, basically, I need to add these three items here. The first one, OS, and OS basically the value for this OS will be this object and passing the logo to update the logo for login page and also for get password page. And head this is for the browser tab icon to change that icon. You need to set it uh, using this, uh, changing this webcon to be uh, your new logo instead and also this for the menu if you need to change the menu icon so it will be as well look like this so the key be to be called menu then the value this object inside just adding this logo and we don't have this logo basically we need to create this logo so to get this logo basically we need to create a folder inside this admin the folder called extensions and then inside this extension we need to add our logo so i have already here this logo in my local host I need to drag and drop it just inside this folder uh, now I have that logo and I can import it here before this const this is a direction dot slash extension slash doing dot png this one here so now if I save this one this is to change the icons so and if I need to change the label for example if I need to change this title and this subtitle then I need to add a translation section so here after this menu I can add the translation section basically this translation key then the value will be this object and inside this object you need to add your uh, language a specific language that you need to update the label for in my case I'm going to update this only for English and you need to get this key this is the key that would to represent for example if i log in this is to represent the menu uh, title so this menu title which is called just app.component.leftmenu.navbrand.title and this one for the subtitle this is the key to update this subtitle here and this one to update the welcoming this is in login page and host page and uh, this one for the subtitle, this is the title on the login page and this is the subtitle in login page. And this one here to remove or to update 
uh, this link here i'm going to show you on the profile if you see this here we have this link we need to remove this link unless for example if you need to uh, deploy this to your production you need to not allow uh, the admin to access a strap documentation so you can remove this one which you are keeping all of this part but you can change this entirely as what you would like as you see this is a value basically you can type here whatever you want and uh, where you can get this key from basically this you can get them from uh, you can see the example basically if you take a look on this node modules and then go to strapi here inside the strapi then here inside the strapi if you go just to admin and then admin then go to tra translations and then from here this list of json translation you can select the ones that you are interested in in, my, in our case we are going to go to english so this is here where you can get all example for that key so for example if you need to just search for this key here and see what is that look like so if you do control f and say that you can get here and same if you need to change any one of exist label here basically you can copy the label and for example this profile here if you look for profile you would find this profile this is the key you can take the key and override the profile instead of profile to be whatever you want to call it but basically this is where you can get the list of keys and uh, now we updated the translation so we need to save this after saving we need to go to the terminal stop the server and do npm run build so we need to rebuild uh, so to get the latest change and then uh, run npm develop <laughs> So now that uh, rebuilt and now we can reload the browser so this will log out then we need to log in again and before log in again so you can see the change if i log out again so now if you see the icon is changed and even the the title and label has been updated if i go to forget password as well this is updated so now if i logged in if you notice the menu icon updated the label and uh, subtitle updated as well and this tab icon has been updated and also if you go to here profile we shouldn't see that link here anymore one more uh, last thing that we need to hide so basically this notification this is a tutorials icon and also to stop the notification where i'm getting this all from basically you can come here to stripe documentation under uh, admin panel customization you can get this list of example and what you can change and actually basically to uh, remove the icon for tutorials and stop notification you can get this part and then at the end here after this translation i can just add this two here so basically this to remove the icon and this one to stop the notifications and as well basically you need to duplicate the same step to run build and then run develop <laughs> So now if I go back again and try just reload the page and see the latest uh, update. So if log in, boom, that the icon has been removed and will not get any notification about Strapi update. So this is how to customize admin UI to update the, any one of these exist labels and also to update icons. And if you would like to see how we can update the localization and we can change to different language, leave that down on the comment section so we can do it in next tutorial. Thank you for watching and see you in very next tutorial.